Hi guys, in this video we are going to learn about the probability. Property means possibility. Number of possible occurrences. Probability value lies between 0 and 1. So this is an extension of permutation combination. The probability of events is equal to number of events by number of samples. There was raining yesterday. There will be raining today. There was raining yesterday. What is the probability of raining today? What is the answer? For this question, this is an uncertain event. Probability is not for uncertain event. Okay. There can be a certain event. When we find three, when we toss three coins, what is the probability of getting at least one head? Okay. At least one head. Three coins, at least one head. What is the probability? Say, when we toss three coins, head, 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 tail, head, tail, tail, head, tail, head, tail, 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 head, tail, tail, head, head, tail, head, tail, head, 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 tail, head, tail, head, tail, tail. Okay? So, at least one head. What is the probability? At least one head. Yes. 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 So except triple T. So all other possibilities are there. So what is the number of events? Number of events out of 8? 7. Totally 8. Number of samples 8. 7 by 8. Okay? So this is the probability. Now we have a question. Ticket numbers from numbers from 1 to 20 are mixed up. And then a ticket is drawn at random. What is the probability that the ticket drawn at random is a multiple of 3 or 5? So from 1 to 20, how many numbers are there? 20 numbers. So multiples of 3, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15 and 18. Multiples of 5, multiples of 5, 5, 10, 15 and 20. So number of events, number of events by number of samples, probability, right? So number of samples, totally 20. Number of events, either 3 or 5. So what is common here? 15 is common here. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And here 3. Because 15 comes twice. So together, 9. So 9 by 20. So answer this question is 9 by 20. Okay, next question, what is the probability of getting 3 digit palindrome? Right? So, how many 3 digit numbers are there? Numbers starting from 100 to 999. So total numbers 900. So this is number of samples. We should find number of events. We should get a 3 digit palindrome. Right? So first digit and last digit should be same. If it is 1, the last is also 1. So in between this digit can be 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. So totally 10 ways we can arrange. Right? First and last 1. Same way 2, 2, 0, 1, 2, 2, 1, 2 like that. There are 10 possibilities. And so on 9. Till 9, 10 possibilities. So 1 to 9, totally 90 numbers are there. So probability is number of events by number of samples. Probability is equal to number of events 90. 90 by 900. This is 1 by 10.